Before I start this video, I just want to say a huge sponsor to Quitted and give her a good luck for her. Earlier, she's getting some haters and other hate, but don't worry, I am here to confront her, telling her that to get well soon and just ignore the haters. We still got her support. Also, apologies that I couldn't make it to Instagram to talk to you, but I will talk to you later. It's just that I was really busy today with work and college. But Friday and Saturday, I'm free. Well, sort of ish, but yeah. Friday and Saturday, I'm free after I'm done with my workout tomorrow and a little errand. Other than that, show your support to Quitted and help her out. But other than that, on to the video. But anyways, hey folks, it's me, M64Bros, and yes, 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 Nintendo is releasing the first trailer for the Super Mario Bros. movie next month on October. And by the looks of it, I'm absolutely excited for the film. A lot of people seemed worried and fear that it's gonna fail, but I'm gonna give my reasons on why I think the film will succeed and what will make the film better. So here are my, like, opinions about it, and here's what I'm gonna say that will probably prevent the film from getting too ugly or not. So here's my opinions. Or facts, I should mean. For one, the official poster of course has the iconic Mario question mark logo, and something tells me it's gonna reuse- It will use the original Mario CGI character designs. Since the original design seemed to still remain in Universal Studios in the USA, of course coming next year in 2023, which I am going to that amusement park for my birthday and my twin sisters as well, so I have a strong sense that they're still gonna use the original character models and designs. And I'm sure of it. Another reason why the film's going to be better is because Shigeru Moto is a part of that film as well as been directing it as well. And don't worry, Shigeru Moto knows what he's doing and he knows what to do and he's gonna make sure this film's perfect. All I know and all I can say is I still have faith for this movie and I know for a fact it's gonna be good. And at least it's gonna be Lords better than the original Super Mario Bros. live action film. Even though that was my favorite film, but I will admit it was terrible. So that's about it for today, but however, I'm making this video quick for one little reason. is to finally end this whole entire Sonic Frontiers drama and give people's hopes and dreams that the game is going to be successful. Here is the official thumbnail, for example, of course it was used over to player Switch Force, blah blah blah. Also, thankfully and successfully, the Switch Force Sucks video I made and Charisma did got over 1k views and everything was absolutely perfect that day. So we finally exposed Switch Force. And as for tomorrow, or the next day if I get the chance to complete it, Sonic Frontiers will be successful, and I'm sure of it. Oh yeah, and also, I'm gonna post more Sonic content later this week as well next week, so stay tuned. And during that week, who knows, maybe I can get Sonic Mania for the Switch later this week. Since I got it on PC, I might get it on Switch as well. But other than that, my plans for tomorrow is to make Sonic Frontiers defense video and see why it's worth it, and it's gonna be lords better than Switch Force this video, and don't worry is gonna be better than Switch Force. And the game itself will be worth it. Other than that, hope you guys liked this video, subscribe for more, and I'll see you guys in the next video. I might do a live stream tomorrow or the next day, but we will see. Other than that, peace out.